Good day ladies and gentlemen, my name is Joshua Bamidele. I welcome you to this YouTube channel. Thank you so much for clicking this video. You are welcome to New M Network International YouTube channel. This is a channel where you have wonderful skits, movies, spoken word songs, wonderful things that are really going to bless your life. So please kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel and then click on that notification bell for you to be notified in case we drop any of our new content. Do well to like, comment and share our content anytime we release them so thank you so much i'll see you again yeah thank you bye You're my sunshine. Mm. You're my star. Oh. You're my princess. Mm. You're my angel. You are my world. Mm. You see, your 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 beauty captivates me to keep longing for you. Oh, Dicky. Your smile is healing my soul. Mm. I can't stop loving you and. I will forever love you. Oh, the king. You have started again. Baby, why now? You you like this Dickin name. I, I don't like it. And I like it. See, don't Dickin me again. There are so many romantic names out there. Just get one or two and that will be okay. Mm, Mr. Romantic. Yes, so that's me, oh baby. Mm -hmm. I would like to sing for you. Wow. So don't mind my voice. Okay. No, I'm not really good at singing like that, but I would sing for you today. You're oh. my baby. All right, I'm listening. Olo lufe wo ju Eh? Sofu mi wo fe mi. I am one fell at Jeff Murrow. That's all do I need to die. Oh, no, no, fair would you suffer me? Oh, fair me. I am one fell at Jeff Murrow. That's all do I need to die. When I thought life was unfair to me and everything seems gloomy, my prince, Charmy Dickin, came to me. again okay my darling Dickin came <laughs> thanks for your love this far mm. thanks for loving my Dora mm. thanks for your support mm. thanks for everything baby I should be the one doing this oh let me do this today only if you know what your presence have brought to my life hmm. mm. I'm flattered. Mm -hmm. See? Ever since you gave me a yes, just a day after I proposed to you, I can see your love for me has grown tremendously. Oh, I can't love you like darling. Same here, baby. Aww. Same here. I love you. I love you. The king, the king. I am fair. How far are you now? You just disappear. You just see your face. You just the busy, busy. This day. What's happen? Don't be like that now. Eh? Don't be like that. I'm saying. You think we say 
I don't finally find the perfect love. And I they give her the kind treat where she wants. Perfect treat. Perfect babe. So don't find me babe, baby. Which one be another babe as if you don't see one million girls with me? Something, me and you know what's are the yana. You don't say you talk better, better. Than <laughs> okay, you don't do. The babe, where are they talk about? She's so. She's so beautiful. See, the first time I set my eyes on her. Ah, oh, no, wow. It was an experience of the seventh heaven. Tell me something. Like, yummy, yummy better talk man here. See, guy, I know the joke. Oh. See, the first time I saw this lady, instantly, chemistry bond biology. See, many people say love at first sight is not real. But I can tell you emphatically that this one real by year by year. I going a day without hearing her voice is a calamity. But the king, you know, I don't trust you, Sha. I don't trust you. Ah, where? Well, I shall trust myself. The king, the king. Mm. So I can't tell you. What you happen to Shade? Shalewa? Booking and Bukola now. Now, when you won't say bad thing, you de remember to de put Dickin, Dickin, Dickin. <laughs> oh, now Dickin the call for church now. I've been not be Dickin the call for church. Ah. Hmm. Just Dickin. <laughs> Dickin with Ja. Sabi guy. Me, I don't know. I don't know. Just trust me now. Trust me. I know they do that kind of thing again. I don't reach my bus stop. I don't reach my final bus stop. Bus stop you call? Yes. I'm finally settling down. I'm marrying. Final finance. Stay there. I don't go marry. Yeah, you bad. Eh, I don't go marry. <laughs> yeah, I don't go marry. <laughs> wow. Have a new daddy. <laughs> see, see, see me, see me, see me. Your daddy's going to take care of you and me. Much more than I ever done for you. Daddy will buy you shoe, bag. Do you want aeroplane? Daddy will buy you aeroplane. And jeep, big jeep. What again do you want? Rice. Eh uh -huh. Jollof. Jollof. You like jollof rice? I you know you like jollof rice. What again do you like? Pop. Pop off. Again, what again? What again should we do? You want to know me too? Very good. Come here. Thank you, Jesus, for giving me beautiful hashes. I'm so grateful for you bringing Dickin to my way. Hmm. I wonder how my life will have been if I'm still with you. What's happening to you? Why all this? Hmm. I have never met such a radiantly glowing lady like you. Hmm. In fact, I love what I'm seeing. And what's that? See, I, I, I don't know how to explain this. I, I, I'm in mood. Mood? What mood, Dickin? Please, leave Dickin out of this. Leave Dickin out of this. You won't believe I'm in mood right now. I'm in mood. Please, ah. just, just permit me this once. I still don't get you. For what? The king. Who? Oh. Again? Hmm. 
okay since we'll still be getting married and you know, we are already working towards marriage so enjoying ourselves shouldn't be as in it's only a sin when we do it or if we do it and i didn't marry you eventually that is the sin go 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 that's the sin we have to test our sexual compatibility and know how sexually compatible we are <laughs> says compatibility you say yes <sighs> what is happening to me again you see sex before marriage is a sin even if tomorrow is our wedding we still can't do it oh you you are not getting me right out people this is wickedness i, I, I say get out you mean you want to leave me this hungry people is i'm still a man of god oblige me just this once what the word of god says is more important than a word of a so-called man of god that chose to go against the word of god favor are you in any way referring to me please sir don't dare me i will shout and my neighbors around they will hear my voice it's okay it's okay it's okay, it's okay. Heart. It's okay. What you did for me the last time was really rude and inappropriate. I never expected that. And what you did was an offense close to rape and molestation. I should be the one shocked eh? not you. You are a deacon in the church, one of the ministers of God. I mean, I was rather blown off. <laughs> what I asked for was nothing. You only gave it too much attention and consideration. It's one of those things. One of what, sir? Which one is I again? Which one is I? See, let me tell you something. I cannot do without sex before marriage. It's not in my nature. Oh, your nature. With all due respect, sir, where is the divine nature of Jesus Christ you preach during the last week Sunday school? Where is it? Oh, you don't even have it. <laughs> Babe, see, you are still new in the faith. You are very new in the faith. See, if I will marry you, then I must check our sexual compatibility. It's a key for me. Oh, for the record, sir, I won't and I can't. Jesus has delivered me from sin. Oh. And I won't entangle myself with any sin. Then consider this relationship off. Huh. I'm done. The king. Which useless deacon are you calling me? Yes. Which useless deacon are you calling me? See, you rub my back, I rub yours. How many men out there will even marry an after one lady just like you? See, I am doing you a great favor by coming to you and say I want to marry you. Come to think of it. See, if truly you need a man in your life, then come to my abode tonight. Dicky! Ah. It's three days now. And Ayofe has not called me. But how how can I break? The covenant of sexual purity with God once again? Hmm. 
Dicky Nayofe has done so many good things in my life. And that of my baby, he added color to my great life. I've been blessed since I've met him. Or have I been too religious? Concerning his request, maybe I was. Since he is the deacon, is better in position to know God more than I do. Hello, Dick and Iofe. I was surprised to see your text message last night. Um, yes, Favor. Though recently I've been dealing with a whole lot of things like family, maritas and the likes. But while I was thinking about so many things, your name sprung up. And I guess you're about to make a critical decision that will affect you. No. Favor. I know you. You are hiding something. Look at me. You are hiding something. Okay. I is Dekin. I'm sorry if I will be so blunt with this. Or as Dekin be asking says from you. How did it happen? Hello, Dekin Ayafa. I know you will call back. Was that the greetings I should have received? I am happy you are back. Can't you just apologize for not calling me since that very day? I will apologize when you come tonight by 8 p.m. Oh, apologize. I won't be able to make it tonight. I'm having an assignment given to me by my boss, so I won't be available tonight. Oh. It's paining me already, baby. I'm missing you. I miss you, Femi. Femi, my baby. I'm missing you too. Okay, what of tomorrow night? <laughs> Let's wait and see. Is that a yes? I should come. Wow. All right, baby. I'll be expecting you. Love you so, so, so much. Love you too. Whew. I don't know. I think I'm falling. The cravings were so intense on me. I couldn't control my emotions. Then. To tell him that I'm coming to sleep over in his place tonight. Favor. Is it not the same man that told you that he was pitying you by telling you that he wants to marry you, that you want to go and spread your legs for? Favor. Is it not the same man that threatens you that if you want a man, you have to sleep with him? Mm, he's the one. Favor. Who did he think he is? He's trying to play on your vulnerability and condition. Favor, wake up. This is a wolf in sheep clothing, my dear. Favor, is God pitying you? No, no. So if God is not pitying you, who is man to pity you when your father is not pitying you? See, Favor, my father have so many sons that are ready to do his will irrespective of the conditions. Please, favor, don't lose your guard. Such a man is not born again. He only have a form of godliness, not the power. And my advice to you is that you allow him to find God. Because if he finds you with that God, my dear, you are in for a disaster. 
So what do you have to say? I'm sorry I missed our agreed appointment. Please go straight to the point. Okay. As much as I'm interested in loving and marrying, I can still jeopardize my spiritual love with God with the, you know, pleasure of a of few minutes. I can't. And even if I don't, I know Jesus loves me. He loves me more than what any man on earth can give. Really? The reason I asked us to meet majorly is to kindly beg you to retrace your steps in the Lord. You see, Jesus still loves you and wants you back. It's obvious you've gone far away, far from him, with what is coming out from your mouth. Jesus still loves you. He wants you back. Goodbye, sir. This worthless. I mean, useless. Hmm. Can Jesus still forgive me? After sleeping with seven youths in the church and several others outside the church in the last seven months. I was indeed named with Christ, but my lifestyle is nothing compared with Christ. My lifestyle was very far away from the lifestyle of Jesus Christ. I was indeed named with Christ, but my character, my behavior is indeed far from that of Christ. I only carry the form of godliness, no power thereof. Please, Lord, Lord Jesus. Can you please take away my sin? Please have mercy on me, Lord. Create in me a new heart, O oh God. Cleanse me from my transgressions and remember my iniquities no more. Have mercy on me, Lord. Have mercy on me, Lord. Mercy on me, Lord. 